Now that we all know that Scientology only spreads hot air and has no authorization, the fun can begin. A walk at the festival, more fun at the festival, exuberant fun at the Scientology festival. Take a bike ride with good friends on the L. Ron Hubbard Way. How many of you observant viewers believe Scientology has a permit for these useless nets? Yep, the LAPD believes that bullshit. Again, it was a pleasure listening to the officers cry. Take some baby wipes. Clean up your little attitude when you're done being immature. Show us a permit. Lara, thank you. Also, breaking discoveries from our investigative journalists. Have fun, guys. Let's go. Aja took a little walk around the slightly crowded festival on L. Ron Hubbard Way yesterday. She is very happy about her constant companion, Sea Org member William, a.k.a. James. He is always up for a good joke and always has a lot to tell about the time he worked as a security guard for little David Miss Cavage. He also likes to talk about how his wife was sent to Clearwater and he will probably never see her again. Although his knee still hurts a lot, he enjoys walking with Aja through this great festival, which has been going on for almost three weeks now and is a great success. Five years old, I don't like grown men following me. Stop following me. Stop stalking me. Stop stalking me. Stop stalking me, please. Normal kids playing. Normal. Totally normal. I don't see nothing wrong with that. Oh, it's the same guy over here. Huh? What? How are you? How you doing? I don't know. You know what? Stop. I'm not causing a disturbance. I'm just walking by myself freely. Okay, well we're not gonna we're not gonna block the driveway. Sorry, I am moving. Look at I'm moving. I'm, you asked me to keep moving. I'm moving, right? I'm doing what you asked me to. You said keep moving. I'm moving. I'm not stopping. Look at this. I'm not stopping. No, you're not welcome here. No, you're not welcome here. This is my city. I pay taxes in this city, so I'm freely to walk in my city that I pay taxes. Asking me for your 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 offer decline. Your offer decline. I know you're laughing, right? I know it's funny, right? I know it's funny. Just let me record. That's it. It's free America. I live in America. It's First Amendment. Let me record. Why are you infringing my First Amendment to record? Stop harassing me. Listen, I was raped when I was five, five years old by an old man, and I have trauma. I have trauma of men following me. Okay, well, tell him not to, to tell him to stop following me. I'm going to ask kindly one more time. Stop telling me what to say and what to do. Okay, I'm, I'm almost gonna be a senior. Stop telling me what to do or what to say, respectfully. Kelly always likes to be on the L. Ron Hubbard way and has made friends with one of the security guards for a few days now. He is very shy and covered in a mask, but he also likes to tell Kelly about his experiences with the Scientologists and also about his untreated back pain, which torments him every day. As always, Kelly is very understanding and suggests a short walk. Exercise is always good for back pain. Her covered companion gratefully accepts her suggestion, and they walk a few steps together. You just walked through? You just walked through from Kaiser? Yeah. Oh. Yeah. Nice to try. Don't touch me, though. Okay, I know. I know you're don't not. Don't touch me. No, I won't touch you. I won't. Not touching. Don't get mad not touching. Sir, you're, you're wider than I am. That's not, hold on, my back's Hold on. Hold on. <laughs> Dude. And also, you're not, it's a area. You're not I know it is. Here. I know. I'm agile. I'm agile. <laughs> come on, show me the. Here. Okay, come on, let's go for a walk. Come on, let's go. Hold my hand. We'll do it together. Aw, back up, back up. She caused the barrier. He says, "Come on, show me the permit." There's lots of things. Do you know about AmeriCorps? You could join AmeriCorps. It's a volunteer job for, well, America. But um, you get like a stipend at the end to go back to school. And you can help. Um, there's Conservation Corps, depending on your age. But you can do like trail work or help clean up um, disaster areas, things like that. It's like, um, what's it called when you, what's it called when you volunteer elsewhere? And it's volunteer, but you get a stipend. I think you get about eight, six to nine hundred dollars a month, and you help. You can do service to families and children, at-risk youth, or you can do um, 
other social service type things, but you'll get placed in a in a area to do a service for nine months, not a full year, and then it, you get a stipend. It's it's legit enough, and then AmeriCorps, but both have good good packages. You get money out of it. That wasn't so difficult, was it? You want to go back? You have to go back to your post. Odo, I feel like he's avoiding me today. How long do we have to do this? Are you considering this your property as well? Well, it's hot, dude. Come on, I'm worried about you. Don't you have a mother that look like, or a, a caretaker? I don't mean to say mother, not everybody has one. That would worry about you, aren't you? Getting a rash or some heat rash? You have the heat rash? It's hot in there. I think it's uh, akin to what the people call hell, hell on earth. It's very hot in there. Kelly has even more fun when Lara is there too. She's been friends with all the Sea Org members for years and it's always a big hello when they see each other again. William aka Jason doesn't even get a chance to speak. Lara has so much to tell him. Jason only ever has work on his mind and he worries about the safety of pedestrians. You're in violation of the permit. Show us the permit. This is now being considered malice. Show us the and permit. And disturbing the peace. Yeah. <laughs> in America, this is not disturbing the peace in America. It might be for you guys. Fine. We can't. Find the permit online. No, we can't. Get off the, get we off can't. The, this is a permitted area. No, it's not. No, it's not. Your f***ing permit Wait. got fault. Oh. You guys fucking delete shit. You're in violation of the permit. So. You, you're a f***ing dumbass. You're literally a dumbass. Yeah, that's right. You're a dumbass. What are you going to do? Area. What are you going to do? Don't tell me the one you white it out and edit it, you fucking coward. Show me your fake permit, the one you white it out. You guys are on record. You guys are on fucking record for your your uh false for actually, yeah, false. It's on me. It's on me. You look at him. Hurry up, finish talking. You guys are literally illegal, little fuck. Supporting illegal, just for what? What are you doing it for? And I saw you the other day with Tori on the camera. Yes, we've seen how this woman dealt with Tori and Solomon. I don't think she even knows what she's protecting. Shit! Okay. What? I don't know what. I, I'm sure somebody came off as being rude or whatever, but you should look into why we feel so defensive when they hire people who don't know about it to protect it, right? So I'm sorry that you feel that you, you have to do something, but also I would go on YouTube and look up SPTV. Yeah, you may be pissed you'll hear my when you story find out. Why I'm fucking pissed. Let him leave the Sea Org. Why do you guys have to keep my father in the lowest position? Why don't you just let him leave and be with me, huh? Think about that. That's some fucked up shit. How is that so beneficial for Scientology to make sure that my own father doesn't speak to me or see me on Father's Day? That's very loving. That's that's really helping the planet become a better place. Jason, you don't even see your own wife enough. My father stays disconnected from me. Why is that L. Ron Hubbard? Why? Henry also tries his luck with Jason and invites him over for a few beers and delicious souvlaki. No, seriously, you ever have souvlaki? Or have you ever heard of it? Dude, I'm, I'm not even here to troll you. I'm sincerely asking, have you ever had souvlaki? How long has it been since you've been to the beach? How long would you say if you had to estimate? I don't even know you, Jason. Would a, would a truly evil, hateful person be out here offering to give you a couple beers, chill at the beach? What do you think? Unfortunately, that Osa guy shows up again and messes everything up. I think Jason would have liked to go to the beach with Henry for a few beers. A day off to relax and unwind. That would be nice, wouldn't it? Very, very delicious. But the, the trick is you gotta have, you gotta have the perfect, kind of pita bread. You can't have the flat pita bread that you get over at like a, I don't know what you guys have here, like a Whole Foods. 
It's too thin. You gotta get the one that's like a little puffed out. You know, like when you make fried dough and it has that little uh, fatness to it? That's the perfect kind of pita bread for a souvlaki. Just to offer you a couple of beers and sandwiches. Offer another stranger the opportunity to hang out at the beach, enjoy the warm sun. You look how beautiful this is. I invited this gentleman as well. Yesterday, Henry had decided to free the easements from these useless nets. He wants to reclaim the freedom of public land that many men and women have fought hard for in the past. Besides, these wooden stakes are a tripping hazard and the dogs can't walk on the grass. Rumor has it that Scientology is doing this for the city and wants to plant new grass. What? That makes no sense at all because it looks great and those nets do nothing for the lawn. It was William Jason Johnson Jacobson Jordan Jingleheimer Schmidt. And word around the SPTV campfire is he's not happy. He's the one whose wife is in Florida, not Odo's. But I'm glad you said it. It reminded me to tell him that if that ever happens, I'd have his back. Oh, how do you know a sign toe when you see him? You peace sign and they glare at you back. I do, but I never carry it. It's in my car down the road. Just give me, ha, uh, folks, it's gonna be a pause. Sorry, you're gonna have to go to Ernie's, ch Ernie, God damn it, you guys. Henry's channel, don't call him that. I'll start calling him that. Henry had just finished his live stream because he wanted to eat something when the LAPD showed up unexpectedly. They wanted him to voluntarily sign a trespassing warning. What? Now the LAPD is getting really weird. Imagine you have a house and you call up the LAPD and ask pedestrians who have never been on your property to sign this piece of paper. This is literally only possible for Scientology, not the average citizen. Can you sign a trespass uh, letter for that property then? Can you... No, this is wrong, sir. You don't have to do it. Yeah, I don't have to. Yeah. That's what I'm asking you if you want to sign it. No, yeah, it's, it's a silly question. Why would I? I'm not on my what? property. Another thing, brother. Hey, uh, they have you on camera fooling out this, this mesh here from the grass. Okay, you got to stop doing that. Why is, is that? There, is there a reason why you're pulling out the mesh? In the grass? Is, is, there, city's is there a reason you asked the question that much? Huh? Is there a reason you asked the question that particular fashion? Me. Well, you're implying something. I want to know what it is. That's all you do. Yeah. What? Yeah. Well, so what? Yeah, so you're damaging the city's property. That's it. That's the property? They, yeah, it's the city's property. Which, which part? The mesh. And the the mesh? Yeah. The how's, how's that? It's the city's property that it, they pay for. How, yeah, how? The how? What, what oh. mean, is there a permit for that? There is. Let me see it. I don't have it. Oh, well, then it doesn't exist. Okay, well, but like I said, they're going to do the stuff for fire to take the camera. I'm just letting you know. Okay, we're not doing anything about it now, but I'm just I'm just warning you because they might take further action. And I don't want anything happening, you know? Um, officer, um, I'm, I'm so, so just to let you know, the city did not put that the, the match there. It was... Oh, so you just... They, they Can I finish before you before you interrupt me, please? Yeah. I'm so sorry. Um, Barajas, Barajas. Scientologists were the one that were putting that uh, the work right there. Yeah, yeah. So, so how is that? The, the, wait, can I free, finish, please, officer? You seem like you're in a rush. You're being yeah, disrespectful. Sure. You don't let us speak. You already come here with an agenda, and I'm sorry, officer, but I, ha I I'm very respectful to all the officers okay. until they start exceeding that type of behavior you're giving me. Okay, go ahead. So I'm gonna again give you the respect you deserve as, an, as a law enforcement officer, please don't make me change that. Okay, All right, thank you. So um, we saw Scientology uh, members, the one wor working for that. So you're telling me that the city pays Scientology, so Scientology can do the work for the city? Doesn't the city have uh, actual, actually city workers to do that? Why do they have to pay Scientology people to do that work for the city? I'm a taxpayer. I don't approve of that, huh? I'm talking about this East Main, I'm talking about this sidewalk, I'm talking about the street over there, the corner over there. They say that it's restricted, but they don't show us anything and it's not posted anywhere that said this area is restricted. Like, see the sign right there? That say the sign, the sign says that, that see, see how it says? It, it tells the people what the gate does. So why is it there no sign posted anywhere that says that it's restricted? So 
the law. It's just as a, as a decent human being. Can we agree that it's kind of a bad feeling, like a bad thing to kind of go to someone's work and just take out the mesh? I, just something to we'll agree on. That's it. No, com- no comment. The two officers want to talk to the Scientologists and ask them for the permit, and also that they make this permit public. Basically, they say the same thing the LAPD always says. The whole thing is nothing but hot air. And then Lara came, and she vented about the bullshit they were saying. Are you able to come back around and tell us what they said? Because they should just say, yeah, sure, officer, here's the permit. It should be as simple as that. Thank you. Uh, why don't you, are you able to take a picture of it when they do so that we can see it? Because why, why would we not be able to see the permit? No, it's public. You don't even know what you're saying. You literally don't know what you're saying. That's the stupidest thing I've heard. If we don't have the authority as a fucking civilian to know the fuck, what an idiot. This is why, this is why you guys are disrespected. How would you not show us a permit when you're coming to address us with something? It's immature. Sure. No, I'm not. I literally just, no. You're fuck. I was born and raised in this shit, so I know what I used to do to police officers to get them on Scientology's side. Okay? So the fact that you're just wiping this over like it's not a big deal and you're trying to trespass somebody voluntarily, that's a fucking idiotic move. You just came up to him. I don't want to talk. Go show us the permit. So we'll be here. If you guys can show us a permit, I would respect you 100%. Until then, you're kind of just like asking me to do something that I don't have to fucking do. And that's disrespectful. Yeah, you did. You were literally, yeah. You were trying to say that we are, that they're trying to give us a trespassing. You ask the people that here protesting signs. You know what? Go take some baby wipes. Clean up your little attitude when you're done being immature. Show us a permit. And then we can have a respectful conversation. If you show me a permit, I will have a very respectful conversation with you. Our investigative journalists are searching for the tunnel, and they have stumbled upon a hot lead. Equipped with high technology, they follow every lead they can find and dive deep into the darkness. I can tell you this much in advance. They have found something. Stay tuned and guess what it could be. See, look at that. There's a rope. Yeah, there's, there's a rope. rope. There's a rope. What is that rope, rope doing there? Holy shit, he's right. That's a giant it's a fucking rope. rope. It's what t- is a rope doing there? That is, yeah. It's small, though. I'm actually next to another rope right here. Like that. So, oh, right here, next to me. That's a yellow rope. Oh, we're going, right we're going, there, we're going more in. You got it? Yeah. We're going yeah. more in. Let's fix this cable. There's a rope. Why would they be a rope by the... In the sewer drain. Oh, I think you're on it. On the box. Yeah, yeah, he's on the yeah, yeah, he's on the box right now, actually. Yeah, you're right on top of the box. If we were able to read that what it says, that'd be pretty cool. Yeah, no, that's a whole that's a whole box down there. It's like something fell in there. I don't know. That's they a pretty big box. A yeah, that's a huge box. Yeah, Probably like it kind of looks like a little step, step into that's or something. That's what I thought I saw here. Step when I was going in. That's what like against the wall. Somebody said this is where OT9 <laughs> is hidden away. Oh, yeah. I'm literally biting my nose. Don't worry, chat. I'm here. I'm here to Wait, keep you Wait, you got your safe. flashlight? I don't know if your flashlight will help shine oh, yeah? from the top down. Yeah, do that? yeah, yeah. Oh, you want yours? Yeah, yours probably here. better. Yeah, I can hold that. You want? Can I see anything? Smart. Probably not, huh? No. It's too bright. Oh, put it, put it on the lower the setting. Right there. Yeah, right he wants to be able to see too. No, I want to see where I'm pushing that this thing right here. Mm-hmm. Now it's going too down. bright, no? Going, going down, hold on. Going down. Oh, we get water. There's water right there. Yes, water, water. Water. I'm, I'm touching water now. Warm water? Mm. Yeah, there's yeah, there's that's water. water. We're water. Found water. Yeah, that Titanic. <laughs> Octopus. I feel like there's also some things that have to block so that things don't get 
inside the water, right? Like from here, like all the trash and stuff? No, it wouldn't because... So you kind of have to go around that. Look, there's a, there's a whole box right there. The same yellow box, huh? Yep. Yeah, I see a yellow box. Wires. So this is not a sewer drain. Well, the, uh, partial, right? The, partial. the box seems like to be like forgotten there or so. No? I don't know if you guys can see there, but I can see from the hole right here. Hmm. Let's fix it. Put it here that way. Just pull it out? No. <laughs> I feel like this looks better in my screen, perhaps. What is Bell system? Telephone company. I know, but why is this? It very well might be... Actually, Bell's buying no more. Oh, you said Pacific Bell. stuff was under her. Yeah, I was, that's, they're not around anymore. Yeah, Pacific Bell's not around anymore. Right there, you guys can read the box, huh? No. Uh, no? Not read. No. But we but see I'm just... I'm something back with me. <laughs> it's hanging on to the... I don't look like one. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like it's in the hanging. No? Right here. Let's continue with the next attempt. I feel like it's about there's, water, there's water down there. Like, that side well, of the water. Sure I'm not sure if I'm supposed to assume it. We touched the water. It's going to smell like shit now. <laughs> <laughs> really you you see? 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 It's not moving no more? Yeah. It's, it stopped right there. Pull it out a little bit, just so you see. Yeah. Oh shit! We got the cops coming. Oh no! They're not for us. They're not for us. Look at the back. 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 Look at yeah, yeah. through the water. It don't, it don't look dirty. No, the water don't look dirty. There's clean water flowing. Yeah, yeah. So based on oh, water in there. Yeah. Based on our shit. investigative journalism work. Oh shit! Yeah, no, that is that is water. He's it's right there, Chef. It is a sewer drain going through. Yep. It's based on investigative journalism work, there's no tunnel Sorry, above DOA. the sewer. Sorry. <laughs> yeah. On this part. 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 Yeah. On that part, yeah. See? We're getting closer. Let's continue with the next attempt. You got tons of lead left, so you're good. Keep going. It's like a hard sitting there, bro. <laughs> yeah, that's what it's for, actually. So put inside your motor and see what's going on. We're still moving. It's a small lift that it might just be catching on. There you go. Yeah, but you're on the... He is doing his investigative journalism work. Well, I guess it's probably just getting stuck on that small lip from... I hope it doesn't get stuck either, because... No. Oh, there's the... There's Damn. The tunnel right there. The hole. It's a hole! Not, not, a, not, a, not a tunnel, the hole. It's a hole! <laughs> the hole. it's a, a drain, hole. Drain pipe hole. hole. Fire in the hole, he <laughs> said. Well done. A few ropes, water, and a hole were found. I think that's excellent work and must definitely be continued in the next few days. I'm just kidding. I'm already tingling all over with excitement. Don't worry, I'm having a clown for breakfast this morning, and that's the reason why I'm particularly funny today. It will pass soon, 